Today I'll compare two powerful dogs, King Corso, origin country Italy, and Kangal, origin country Turkey. Let's find out what makes them better or worse. Intelligence Kangal is an intelligent shepherd dog. In many circumstances, it takes independent decisions and acts accordingly. King Corso is highly intelligent dog. It studies quickly. In this case, my first call for intelligence goes to each. Personality Kangal is an independent thinker, loyal, stubborn shepherd. Because mostly when it's guarding a livestock, it has to take independent decisions. Kangal is very sensitive to provocations, but it can be controlled by the owner. Cane Corso is very brave dog. It's very loyal but less sensitive to provocations than Kangal. Unlike Kangal, Cane Corso is more sociable, though this breed is not much friendly with strangers and it is less stubborn, but Cane Corso's affectionate level is average. In this case, my second score for personality goes to each. Tolerance Cane Corso can't stand being alone for a long time and it barks a lot when it stays alone. Kangal needs some time on its own. For Kangal, to be left alone is quite okay. As for weather, thanks to its double coat, Kangal tolerates hot and cold weather alike. Cane Corso feels better in hot weather. My third score for tolerance goes to Turkish Kangal. Exercise Kangal has high energy level. It's playful and needs daily exercise to be in a good shape. Ken Corso is a high-energy dog too, which needs daily exercise to be in a good shape. My fourth call for exercise goes to each. Grooming needs. Kangal has double coat and sheds a lot. Though Kangal has a short coat, still grooming its double coat is more difficult than Kane Corso's, who also sheds a lot. In this case, my fifth call for grooming goes to Kane Corso. Socialization. Kangal even socialize is not very kid and pet friendly if they don't belong to family. The similar situation is with Kane Corso. It only loves its family and hardly tolerates outsiders. My sixth score for socialization goes to none of them. Guardian Kangal is a guardian dog. Since ancient time, it has been guarding livestock and property. Kane Corso is a guardian dog too. Both of the dogs are fearless protectors. My seventh score for guardian goes to each. Breeding instincts. Common domain instinct in Kangal and in Cane Corso is average. Hunting instinct is below average in Corso and in Kangal. Prey driving instinct is average in Kangal and high in Cane Corso. My eighth score for instincts goes to Cane Corso. Bite force. Kangal's bite force is 743 psi and it has the strongest bite force. Cane Corso's bite force is 650 psi. My ninth score for the bite force goes to Turkish Kangal. Health Now let's compare Kangal's and Cane Corso's health. In general, both dogs are healthy dogs, but there are diseases these dogs suffer from. Kangal may have hip dysplasia and fatty tumors. Cane Corso mostly suffers from obesity, hip and elbow dysplasia, bloat, eyelid abnormalities, so called cherry eye, and arthritis. My 10th score for health goes to Turkish Kangal. In the end, in breed traits comparison, the winner is the Turkish Kangal. There is no big difference. Both dogs are amazing livestock and property guardians. Both are selfless protectors. And which dog is better for you, it's up to you to decide. Hope you found my video informative. Please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you in my other video.